One of the revolutionary features of Excel is being able to create maps. Thinking about maps get us think about latitude, longitude, location, etc. Having Excel, you don't have to worry about any of this. How so? Let's try it together. Hello there. This is Fariha Tumim from Excel Demi, your one stop for Excel blog posts, discussion forums, templates, and VBA related answers. We will learn how to create a map in Excel. In this data set of countries and the number of stores, we will discuss the topic in two ways. We will use Excel 365 for this. You can use any other available Excel versions as well. Let's get down to the video. We want to create a map in Excel. With this data set where we can show the countries on that map and their total number of stores. Select B4 to C11 and go to Insert tab from the Chart group. Click on the Maps drop-down. Here, select the Field map. Now, let's move the map beside our dataset. Now, let's click on the plus sign here. From the Charts element menu, select Data Labels. Now, we can see the number of stores on the map. Now, click on the Brush icon. From the Style tab, you can select any of the styles. Let's select Style 3. Now let's add Chart Title by clicking on the box. Click on the box and here type Map Chart of Countries. Now right click on Chart Area and click on Format Data Series. Now we can see this section pop up in the right side of our screen. From the series color category, select diverging three color, this one, and set color for three point. Let's go with red for lowest, for midpoint, blue, and for highest value, green. Now we can see the map and understand the data here visually. Using the same method, we can create a map for states according to their store numbers. Select the database. Go to Insert, Charts Group, Maps drop-down, this one. If you get this kind of warning, your map chart data will be sent to Bing. Click I accept. Let's drag it beside our database. Let's add data labels. And from the brush icon, let's choose this one. And right-click on it, Format Data Series. From series color, diverging three color, lowest, which is red, middle value blue, and highest value green. Easy, right? In this method, we will create a 3D map for plotting these countries according to their store numbers. Let's select the database B4 to C11. Go to Insert tab and from the Torch group, Select 3D map. Here we can see a new window has popped up for 3D maps. Let's close these dialog boxes, this section as well. Now we can see that there are no countries name available. Click on map labels and it will get you the country names here. Select flat map to get the flat version of the world map. Let's zoom out a bit. There we are. Now, from the View group, click on Layer Pane. And from the Data drop-down, you can see Location at Field to click on Country. And you can see this selection is at Country or Region. That's what we want. Now, click on this tab, which is Change the Visualization to Bubble for the Store Number. Now click on the layer options and let's increase the size to the maximum. You can already see there are blue dots within the map. Let's change the color to red. Now the dots are more visible, right? Modify the size and color according to your preference here. If we use our database for the states, 
we can get a similar visual. You can see that the circles portray the store numbers here. The biggest dot is in New York. As our database, it's New York as well. And the smallest dot is in Utah. It's seven. From these methods, you can choose any of them according to your convenience. You can practice this with the help of the Excel file in the description box below. Let us know if you were able to do it in the comment section. Share your suggestions and feedback as well. Stay tuned by subscribing to the channel and clicking on the bell icon. Like and share the video if it helps you. Thanks for watching.